Hi, I'm Robert May. We're at Pocket Gamer Connect in San Francisco today, and sitting next to me is Victoria Lin from Zenjoy. Uh, so, Victoria, tell us a little bit about yourself and your role at Zenjoy. So, I joined uh, Zenjoy about a year ago as a business development and a marketing director. Uh, Zenjoy was our was my uh, first uh, client when I was at Ablovin. That was about four years ago, and um, I work with them um, on the advertisement side, user acquisition, and then um, I work at a Chinese agency for the mobile gaming uh, user acquisition, and before I moved to Zenjoy. Can you tell us a bit about the evolution of your games? The barrier of entry for casual games is relatively low, but now we want to increase the barrier of entry. That's why we are trying casual. It's not only challenging technically, it's only very challenging operationally. Technically, not many people can do live stream, interactive live streaming. And um, that basically, smaller developers cannot just copy our format. And additionally, operationally, it's very challenging. We need to coordinate like a studio crew. We need to coordinate like content provider. So these things, we probably will make it harder for other people to um, entry this kind of market. So how do you go about building monetization strategies around such different types of games? Um, so uh, Work Connect is, you know, it's like traditional game format. We just use banner, interest, the shows, video, and rewarded video, and the playable ads. Cash show is completely different genre. It's like interactive live streaming. So it's kind of similar. It's like in between TV and games. So um, right now we don't have any monetization yet, no IAP nor um, ads, but later we probably will use similar ads format um, from TV, like um, content marketing, place uh, product placement, and maybe some brand like uh, advertising. So before you worked for Zenjoy, you worked at an ad network. Mm -hmm. So what was What's it like going from one side of the business to the other side of the business? Once I moved to a development site, I feel it's much, much more than just UA and monetization. Like, there's a lot of things about products that I couldn't see as when I was at Ad Network. Like, I need to make sure user is happy with where we insert the ads. We need to make sure, like, our marketing message is correct. And also, like, um, I need to worry about retention rate, the user feedback, like app store ratings, everything. So thank you for joining us today. Sure.